everyone, my name is Bethany and I'm the training manager here at ESWare and today I'm going to show you how to use email tracking. Email tracking allows you to get real-time notifications for every email open, link click, and attachment view, view your progress in your personal and team tracking report, and plan your next move based on your recipient's engagement. To get started with Yesware's email tracking, the very first thing that you'll want to do is go to your preferences and make sure that you're set up for success in your own personal workflow. To begin, you'll want to make sure that track opens is turned on. And then if you're interested in seeing when people are clicking on the links that you're sending to them, go ahead and turn track links on. Colleague events refers to getting notifications when internal emails are being opened by people with the same domain as you. So if you're interested in that, go ahead and turn that on. And lastly, if you'd like to get pop-up notifications real time as people are opening your emails and engaging with that content, make sure that you're turning on event notifications. Now to track an email, you just want to click on the compose button here and obviously put in your recipients. And as long as this track box here at the bottom of the compose window is checked off, this email is going to be tracked. So when you send it to your recipient and that recipient opens it, you'll start to get some open notifications. If you want to track link clicks, to do so, again, just make sure that that Yesware preference to have track links is turned on. And then go ahead and embed the link that you want to send them the same way that you normally would. So we'll do something like check out our website and we will hyperlink the word website and put in the web address we want to send them to. And now you'll notice this has actually changed the underlying hyperlink here to this t.yesware.com, a bunch of different characters, and then the actual web address that we entered. And that's how we're tracking those link clicks by just changing it slightly. So when your recipient clicks on that link, we'll be able to notify you of that link click. Just as a best practice, we always recommend to do a descriptive hyperlink. So what I mean by that is hyperlinking the word as opposed to hyperlinking the web address. And this is simply so that you can avoid getting your emails sent to spam. In addition to link click tracking, we also offer attachment tracking. So if you are sending a PDF, a PowerPoint, a Word doc, Excel file, MP4, anything like that, instead of using Gmail's native attachment functionality, you'd want to use this green attachment button down here. And this allows us to add a tracked attachment. And again, when someone opens your attachment, we will let you know of that that open. And you'll be notified of these email opens, link clicks, and attachment opens in a number of different ways. As mentioned, if you have event notifications turned on in your preferences, you'll start to get pop-up notifications that occur. You'll also start to see in this activity feed the open information here, and it's going to give you a little ticker of the number of events that have occurred since the last time you took a look at it. And when you click in here, you're going to be able to see all of the opens, link clicks, presentation views, etc. And if you click on a specific email, you'll be able to see the full tracking history here in the sidebar. And if you have multiple links that were sent, you can see which links were actually being clicked upon. You'll get a sense of when they were opened, approximately where, what type of device, and you can click through to the actual email thread by clicking on the subject line here. You can also narrow down by those that haven't opened your emails or maybe opened and not replied. So you can plan your follow-ups around that. You'll also see open information just at a high level anywhere that you keep conversations. So these little eyeball icons here will start to populate. And if you hover over them, that will give you some high level open information. So you can kind of see that at a glance. 
And then if you click into a sent message, you're also able to see the tracking information here with this little eyeball icon. And if you click on it, that's going to show you the full tracking information for that individual email. Now for attachment tracking, if you have attached a PDF or a PowerPoint, we're going to provide to you a presentation report that will show you the page by page engagement with that content. And just as a reminder, this is only for PDFs and PowerPoints. For any other type of attachment, we will just say that someone has opened that attachment.